I'm asking you to trust that God math works. Let me say it again because it sounds strange. Trust that God math actually works. Now, what is the difference between world math or regular math and God math? And this is where God's promises to fill your life and to meet your needs in an overabundant way become realized. See, it's really interesting. In our regular math, we might look at it and we say, well, 100% minus 10%. I'm talking about um, giving back to God because one of the principles that God says pertains to this God math is trusting God and putting him first. The very first thing you spend any of that money God has loaned you is to give back to him for its kingdom purposes. And I'm going to talk about that in a moment. But regular Matt says, are you kidding me? 100% minus 10% means I'm supposed to live on 90%. That's less than 100%. Well, obviously it's true. But I'll tell you, God math is different. God works in our lives. When we dedicate part of our lives to him and we give it to him first, not last, not the leftover, but the first before we do anything else, pay our expenses, pay your bills, uh, put money in savings, buy that car, that house. God says, you put me first. Give me the first 10%, that's called a tithe, of your income, and I will make sure that your conduit is always running full. See, God's math says 90% plus God is always greater than 